how to install Final Cut Pro plugins. This quick tutorial will show you how to manually install plugins that you've downloaded to use in Final Cut Pro. And I'll also show you at the end of the tutorial how to create a favorites folder so that you can store your frequently used plugins and have them at hand. You'll usually find that plugins are downloaded to your downloads folder as a zip file as they are here. If they're not in your downloads folder, you're best to go to Spotlight and look for them there. Sometimes a zip file will automatically expand, so you'll see the folder in your downloads folder. But in this case it hasn't, so we'll double click the zip file. So once the folder is expanded, for Final Cut to recognize the plugin, it needs to be stored in the Motion Templates folder. So in the Finder, Go to the Go menu and select the Home folder. And inside the Home folder, you'll see a Movies folder. And inside the Movies folder, you'll see your Motion Templates folder. And there you have Generators, Titles, Transitions and Effects. And all of those plugins are in those folders. So if you don't know what type a plugin you have, then you do need to open up the folder. Now this needs to be done carefully and what I'm going to do here is to open a new finder window and we'll go back to the downloads folder and we'll look inside the social media plugin folder and inside there's a black image file. If you select the file and press the space bar, you can see this is called a project. Now projects always go in the generators folders. It's much e easier for titles, transitions and effects because that little black file is labeled by the name. So if we look inside the titles and we go to the favorites and titles, then you look in there and you can see the black image file press the space bar and you can see it's a title and the same would apply for effects and for transitions they would both be called either transitions or effects. We know that the social media plugin is a generator so we need to drag that into the generators folder inside the motion templates folder. We can see the social media folder there. And as I promised, I'll show you how to create a favorites folder within Generators so you can put your most frequently used files inside. So what you need to do is you need to go to your Motion Templates folder and we'll double click the Generators folder to open it. And then go to the File menu and select New Folder. We'll call that Favorites. And since I've already got a Favorites folder, just for the exercise, I'll call this Fave2 and we'll drag the social media plugin into Fave2. And now when we go to Final Cut and I look in the generators and find the Fave2, you can see there's the switch social and there's the generator tab. And if I put the playhead over it, there you can see that generator. And I hope you found this quick tutorial useful please like and subscribe and press the bell so I can make more of these tutorials for you. Thanks for watching.